hello guys welcome back to this channel hope everyone is fine on that note let's start this video so this is week 2 assignment of the course cyber security and privacy so guys we had we have tried our best to give you the most probable solutions if there are any changes that come to my notice definitely i will update that in the comment section so please watch the video till the end guys don't skip the video you may miss some content if you do that so do watch full video so first of all like this video guys so that everyone will be able to get recommendations about our channel and videos so first question guys cia triad refers to what so what is the full form of c i mean c i a c means confidentiality a means availability and i means integrity so first option is the correct option guys so mark first option confidentiality integrity and availability next second question second question what aspect emerges from the intersection of three components of information security so for second question the correct answer is second option guys policy it is policy next moving on to the third question third question so dash authentication and authorization are means to ensure cia so what is the first blank we have to fill the options with the with one of these options so for third question once again it should be second option guys that is identification it is identification so mark second option as the probable solution for third question now let's move on to the fourth one guys fourth question should all 27 cells of mecumbers cube be addressed with the same priority definitely no right so it is false statement guys so every cell has uh, different type of priorities but not all the all the cells are not the are not having the same priority right so it should be false statement guys uh, false is the probable solution for fourth question now let's move on to the fifth one which of the following is or are the design principles of high availability systems so before getting to know this solution i want to make a small announcement guys so that is regarding exam preparation mcqs for the course cyber security and privacy we have collected the exam preparation mcqs guys here you are going to get a huge number of 115 plus mcqs so these are completely based on past years nptl assignment questions guys along with the answers you will get that in a google drive pdf restricted link guys google drive link with five years of nptl experience we have collected this so for one person it is just 150 rupees only guys so for 115 plus mcqs you will get it for just 150 rupees only for five persons it will be 500 rupees guys combinedly so individually you can get lesser price if you take as five persons right so please discuss this with your friends and classmates guys and take this five persons pack so individually for one person it is individually 150 rupees per group of five members it is 500 guys so individually with 100 rupees only you are getting this if you take it combined for five members so if you want to purchase then mail me to this email id guys bk179417 at the gmail.com so this is our channel's mail id so you can mail me to this email id if you want to purchase so this is our channel email id guys bk179417 at the gmail.com so remember guys only if you are confirmed to make the payment then only mail me guys so discuss this with your college friends or classmates so that you can get reduced price if you take it as 5 percent pack so i'll give the same email id in the description box as well guys so 115 plus mcqs you are getting guys for one person it is 150 for five persons combined it will be 500 rupees guys so that's it guys for this video now let's get back to the solutions fifth question which of the following is or are the design principles of high availability systems so for fifth question it should be fourth option all of the above that is eliminate single points of failure 
ensure reliable crossover identify failures in real time next sixth question guys sixth one in ensuring confidentiality what is the crucial process that involves classifying information and individuals and mapping them based on the level of access so for sixth question it should be option one guys identification it is identification so mark first option as the probable solution for sixth question now let's move on to the seventh one guys please share this video with your friends and classmates guys so that everyone will be able to note these solutions along with you so that they will also get benefited guys so seventh question in addition to cryptography a number of measures may be used for confidentiality including what so for seventh question it should be all of these guys information classification secure document storage application of general security policy so all of the above is the correct option for seventh question so mark fourth option as the probable solution for seventh question guys now let's move on to the eighth one eighth question when a control provides assurance that every activity undertaken can be attributed to a named person or automated process it is known as what so for eighth question it should be second option accountability it is accountability so mark second option as the probable solution for eighth question guys next ninth one guys if you want to want me to change any solution or if you have different opinion about any of this solution you can please suggest your opinion regarding the correct answer in the comment section guys so we can discuss positively so ninth question identify the components of information security so once again these three options so mark all of the above as the probable solution for ninth question and moving on to the final question of the assignment that is tenth one which are the three types of four macombos cube identifies so once again i want to make you remember guys so for the course cyber security and privacy we have collected the exam preparation mcqs with 5 years of nptel experience so you are getting a huge number of 115 plus mcqs guys in a google drive pdf restricted link so for one person it is 150 rupees only guys for if you take it as five members combined pack you can combinedly get it for 500 package only guys so five members can share that 500 price so this is the mail id guys bk179417 at the rate gmail.com i will give the same email id in the description box as well guys so mail me to this email id only if you are confirmed to make the payment so that's it guys now let's get back to the last question of this assignment that is 10th question right so for 10th and final question the answer is fourth option guys all of the above so friends these are the solutions for week 2 assignment of cyber security and privacy course so hope this video helpful for you if you feel the same please subscribe our channel like this video and definitely share this with your friends and classmates guys and don't forget to take this 115 plus mcqs google drive pdf restricted link pack it will help you in the preparation for the final exam guys so that's it guys for this video so keep supporting me like this if you are still not subscribed to our channel then please subscribe our channel definitely like this video guys and please share this video guys and this news with your friends and classmates so that's it guys for this video so until the next video goodbye thank you